Hi Survivors, it's me, Prepper Zan, Prepper Zan reporting to you. Hope you guys are doing well because what's going on in this world is not. I was looking at the um, weather ch channel, you know, uh, I always get my weather news and information from Weatherman Plus. Now also check out this other particular weather channel uh, that I, I look at and they were talking about uh, because of the drought out there in California, they saying that it's going to be a 25 to 40 percent decrease in foods, um, and particularly like the oranges and tomatoes because of that of that lack of rain and that weather that is you know excessive heat, and uh, they also have serious 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 water problems they face in there, and they right by that ocean and also in Arizona. This is what I want to talk to you guys about. They saying in Arizona, Scottsdale, they they gonna have to shut out shut off the water uh, come January. Could y'all imagine if you're in an area right now and they have to shut off the water and they're telling everybody they don't know when the water gonna be back on? Could could you just imagine what kind of environment it would soon become? People go crazy. And that's why it's important. And I think about these things, man, because I'm like, anytime you happen to depend on somebody else, that, that you're taking a high chance of risk of not being able to uh, have that thing that you're depending on them for. And, and our situation is everything. I don't know how we've allowed this all this time. It's everything from the shelter to the clothing to the food to the water. I mean, and there's so many people. I don't know how we didn't get together before and just... Everybody just got comfortable and convenient and lazy with this system that didn't set us all up, allegedly. <clears throat> and so now I'm sitting up here thinking, I'm like, wow, if they turn off the water and they said, okay, this certain day after that, we don't know when we'll resume to be able to provide you water or you got to fight, find, find water for yourselves and your families. Could y'all imagine how crucial it's going to get, I, I believe those times we're facing, it's already starting to happen. They're saying this is going to start going to begin the beginning of next year. Y'all, that's like, what, four months down the line? September, October, November, December, today is the first. So, <laughs> oh man, it's always going this is serious. This is like attack on the food and, but you know, you can't call, most people won't call it attack on food and water when it's coming through what they would call climate change allegedly <laughs> man we in for the fight of our lives you know i just hope that people um will wake up and start preparing and start figuring out what 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 they, what they're going to do or what we're going to do in regards to being able to survive all this a lot of people just don't don't have it in them, you know. Then you have a lot of people who, unfortunately, just don't have help. They might have disabilities. It's just this is a lot. This is a lot. This is a lot. But I just wanted to share that with y'all. I'm not gonna rant on and on, but um, I think these are things <clears throat> I bring it to all of our attention when I hear about it, and I thank you guys for bringing things to my attention as well because this is stuff we have to really prepare for, not just think and ponder on. Cause it's here, y'all. This is it. We want to survive these times and live to see our kids and grandkids or, you know, let us see the future. We got to just start getting, you know, lining things up to, to try to go that way. Is it easy? No. But is it worth it? I believe so. I believe so. All of us don't have to result to these people way of living and way of thinking. You know, God has set a lot of us aside to have some common sense. I think they already had this plan years ago. Allegedly. Y'all just prep like you never prepped before. And I'm telling myself this as well. I'm telling myself most of all. I'd be figuring out more water sources. That's what I'm concerned about. The water. They're talking about the water drying up the food. I, man, you go a long time without eating food. I'm telling you. A lot of us can afford to not eat right now for a long time anyway. 
and detox our bodies from all this nastiness that they put in the food. Allegedly. All right, y'all. I want to share that with y'all. Y'all tell me what y'all think about that. They talking about top, turning off the war in the sky still. Google it. I just heard it this morning. In, in Arizona saying this is already a done deal. They're telling the people by the beginning of next year, that's it with the water. <sighs> Please follow me on my other platforms. Hit the thumbs up button. Um... If you're looking for land and bug out areas in Texas, I have some for sale and for lease. Please support the the allegedly t-shirts and the good luck with that t-shirts. And um, y'all watch this world, watch the weather, smell your water, boil your water before you use it. All these products that I've been endorsing in this video are mine as a YouTube disclaimer. And keep surviving.